All right, what is going on YouTube? So today we're gonna to be installing the RS7 spark plugs here. They're a step colder, getting ready for stage two. So I got them all right here lined up. Let's go ahead and start the process. First thing we're gonna do is remove these 10 millimeter ground nuts off the top of the coal packs. Yep. All right guys, so we got the uh, 10 millimeter ground nuts off. So now the whole stud can come out. There you go. Okay, so we got the coil packs all unplugged there. Now the coils are ready to come out. All right guys, so we got all four spark plugs out. That's what they look like after about uh, 30K. All right guys, so we got the spark plug in. Use your uh, spark plug socket that holds it in there with the magnet. You can go ahead and drop it down into the cylinder. And just uh, screw it by hand. Yep, screw it by hand. You can go ahead and do that for all of them and then just do a final torque once they're all in there by hand. RS7 plugs installed. Using these for the step colder heat range since we're going to stage two. Now we start putting back the coil packs. Yep. Go Same order them. we took it on. Mm -hmm. Same order we took it out from. Go ahead and put the studs in there. Yep. On each coil pack. Match it up with the hole. Remember guys to screw by hand first. Not with an impact because you can mess up your threads. There you go. Okay, just like that. Shop that. Go ahead and reconnect your coil pack connectors. Make sure you hear a click, and then go ahead and plug in your your grounds. Click. Yep, hear that click. All the grounds are in. You can go ahead and put your ground nuts back on, and just tighten it down. You're good to go. All right, guys. So here we have final product. Everything's plugged back in. We have the RS7 spark plugs installed.